This is Bob Payne, Chief Investment Strategist here at Payne Capital Management with this week's market update. This week on the Street of James, markets fell for the third straight week with its worst weekly performance since March. The S&P 500 fell 2.9%. The technology-heavy NASDAQ composite dropped 3.6%, while the blue-chip Dow slid 1.9% on the week. Bond yields rose after hawkish comments from the Federal Reserve who forecasted one more rate hike for 2023. The benchmark 10-year Treasury yield popped to its highest level since 2007. Markets also sold off among concerns around a potential government shutdown next week, although all past shutdowns had little or no impact on the economy. So what really happened over the past three weeks while I was away on vacation? Well, there are simply more sellers than buyers in the financial markets. But that's how markets work. They spend all their time climbing a wall of worry, and another interest rate raised by the Fed and a potential government shutdown is just one more brick in that wall. Remember, concerns are not certainties, and pullbacks or corrections are always temporary. It's surprising, actually, that investors sell simply because the price of their security goes down or because a Federal Reserve official utters a negative comment. The financial markets represent real companies, and real companies are slaves to earnings, and their values depend on profits. And earnings are growing, and more importantly, forward earnings estimates have just risen to a record high for 2023. More importantly, more importantly, the forward earnings estimates for 2024 and 2025 are actually substantially higher. Now, the market action this week reminded me of the real estate market pre-COVID, you know, when nothing was moving and prices were stagnant. People who lost patience and sold those homes had to sit back and watch those very same properties double and sometimes double again over the next few years. You know, the Dow's trading at 34000 and based on 2025 earnings estimates, with the market trading at the very same valuation as it is today, the Dow could very well be at 43000 Just a gentle reminder that all dips are temporary, every wall of worry is scaled, and new highs are inevitable. Hey, my son Ryan and I, we have 75 years combined industry experience in building low-cost, tax-efficient, goal-based portfolios. For your free evaluation of your portfolio, all you need to do is text or call 844-752-6692. That's 844-752-6692. Or just simply call 844-PLAN-NYC. That's 844-PLAN-NYC. Hey, this is Bob Payne. I'm the Chief Investment Strategist back at Payne Capital Management.